Hello dear friends and most welcome to this lecture. Inside this lecture we are going to learn how to create a simple calculator using JavaScript, HTML and a few CSS. So without wasting the time we are going to start the project. First create a folder here, right click and create a folder. And you can just give a name like simple, simple calculator and we are going to save code here inside this open your code editor so I'm using notepad plus plus if you are using any other code editor so it is good the only thing you need is just follow the code so save this inside this code editor here index dot HTML save and HTML take start then head take start then title take start simple calculator and here you are going to insert the body tag very simple so here style tag also because we are going to use a few line of CSS code inside the body I am just going to insert the center tag first and form tag so inside the form you need to just create an id discard forms you can give any names for id and we are using name attribute here so this can be the same forms no problem so here we are going to use input tag input the type can be something like text and you can just use a name attribute here so this also can be text you can give any other name and ID same thing text and this BR not B BR now save go to run menu and launch your file in Chrome so you can see we have text field here so you can just write number and text so here we have just uh, ID this called forms copy this control C and for ID we are using hash so open curly braces margin from the top i want to just use here 40 pixel of margin from the top for this form you can see 40 pixel or maybe something like 50 pixel control s or refresh so another id we have here for the text control c so you can just use here for id we use hash text curly braces so the width for this should be something like 250 pixel and the height for this should be something maybe 30 pixel let's check A refresh so you can see 250 pixel is the width and 30 pixel we have used height here so after this input we are going to just create some more in, uh, input for buttons first i'm just going to show you calculator so we are going to just create these buttons like one two three till nine zero button call sign plus all this just a simple calculator so input take and the type for button you can just say button and you can just say here value for button you can say one and you can just say on click for right now we are just putting this empty control s now come here and refresh so we have a button here uh, and here is written one on the button by pressing on button i want to just uh, access the one here you can see so you can just write on on click here inside name we have forms you can just copy this paste here and a dot sign inside the second input inside name you have text copy this one and paste here another dot and you want to just access the value from here just a space plus sign then equal sign then these two single quotation then one here insert one control s and you know inside this quotation we can insert a string value and you can just plus a string means one 
plus 1 it means double 1 not 2 Control s now come refresh and you can see it is just working perfectly now the same way you can just duplicate this command plus t or Control plus t i'm just using the vr or just leave now save and refresh now we have three button you can just change this for two and this one can be three the same way you can change from here two and three now refresh so you can see this image uh not image sorry buttons are very small so we are going to use some css to design them so we can just use here input and it will be applied on all the buttons so you can just define a width for this something like maybe 80 pixel and the height like 30 pixel save and refresh so now this better so you can just copy this control c or command c for copy and paste one time two time change the value this can be number four number five number six this also number four number five number six seven eight and nine then also seven eight and nine you can just save this go to your browser and refresh. so you can see we have one till nine but I want to just use a VR after each of these three button. So just come here, use a VR here, and another VR here, and one more we need to use here. Control S and refresh. Now we have button from one till nine. We need some more buttons, so we are just going to paste this two more time. Paste and paste. So this one can be just for plus, this one minus for divide, and this one also the same way, plus, minus, and divide. This one can be for multiply, for zero, we don't have zero button, and this one can be for equal sign, multiply, zero, and equal sign, and just use the VR here and here also a vr control s once again refresh so you can see the plus button minus uh, division multiply zero equal signs so one more button we need to hear to whatever you can just insert inside this field you can just clear that by pressing this button so input and the type should be button because we are going to create a button the value can be you can say clear all and one more thing you can just set the id id can be button and on click you can just use here and save so control s now come here and refresh so i want to just give a size for this button the same for like this one so we have just use id here copy the name of id go to your css and paste use a comma here a hash and paste this one here save and refresh now we need some margin top for these buttons so you can just use inside this property margin from the top maybe 9 pixel save and refresh now this is just working better you can just use fading one pixel maybe one pixel of fading or minus control s and refresh and one pixel i'm just looking for two clicks and now you can just write here 25 plus 25 Press equal sign two plus this. We are just going to use a symbol or a short formula for this. This is the equal button. We need to just remove till here. And 
going to use a equal sign here and e v a l you know this parentheses or you can say round number simply copy this control c or command c and paste inside this round number save i'll come here and refresh 25 plus 25 is equal to you can see 50 and you can say just multiply by 8 400 and you can see this much divide on 8 50 minus 40 and so you can see this just working perfectly now i want to just remove the text by pressing this clear all button the numbers which we have inside this so for that we need to just copy this Control C and you can just paste this just use equal sign and a single quotation just like this Control S now once again you have 25 plus 25 50 and you can see it is just working whatever you have inside this text field so by pressing this button you can just clear that so you can just use uh, a nice background color for this so if you are if you know any color so you can just use here but uh, this is just okay if you don't follow you can just use a background color for this kind of text so i'm just going to use here background gray and text color s now come here and refresh so you can see you can just use a background color just like this maybe any other background color just black save and refresh so you can see that this we have just used 25 plus this all you can see it's quite easy this all the code we have just a few code inside css style tech some html we have used here and some javascript inside on click we have just used and this all the code so you can just download the code from the app source section and we are going to just end this video here i hope you like this project and this video have a nice time and see you